there are 6,611 students here this week who have all qualified to come to SARSA. Judges from all over Southern Arizona come and they interview them and judge their projects to try and decide who's the top of the top. I found out that I was going to SARSA and I was just like really, really happy. My parents were really, really happy. To be in SARSEF is one of the greatest rushes of excitement I've ever experienced. I was one of the very few people from my school to be picked. Yeah. SARSEF is a great way to be able to learn and to be able to see so many other people that are passionate about science and just improving the world around them. I've been coming to SARSEF since first grade. This is my seventh year. Uh, so I've been doing it since fourth grade and it's been a really amazing experience every year. Since seventh grade I competed every single year. It was really cool to see that all of the hard work that I put in translated to not only a piece of paper or the board, but also allowed me to go farther and it showed me that I have an opportunity to succeed somewhere. My projects have centered around energy and engineering. Microplastics, runoff and rain. Native and non-native trees and how uh, they affect the communities around them. How glucose can affect the milk that we drink. Investigating how the U.S.-Mexico border affects bobcat population genetics. Pteropods, which are tiny sea snails, now studying how climate change was affecting their habitat size. <laughs> This is one place where I think the future of Arizona is very bright. The deliberations are very serious. This is a life-changing kind of event. We give over $100,000 worth of prizes and scholarships to kids to encourage them to keep working on their science and their engineering. Unfortunately, in our state, our students are not performing the way we want them to on tests of math and science in our schools. And that's where SARSEF can help. SARSEF's vision is every child thinking critically and solving problems. We want them to be critical thinkers and problem solvers because we know that those are skills that are going to last them a lifetime. Equity is so important to us. We really mean it when we say that we want to reach every single child in Southern Arizona. So we focus on Title I schools and we travel all over eight counties in Southern Arizona in order to make sure that we're serving the kids that need us the most. It's so important that we catch kids early because there's been so many studies showing that by the age of five, stereotypes start to leave kids with an impression that they are not good at science and engineering, especially girls and minorities. We're one of the only science fairs in the world that starts at kindergarten, and we are the only one that starts at preschool. We have a really great success rate at the International Science Fair. Our students that go and compete there win at four times the national average. The next award is for innovation in engineering. My junior year at ICEF, I won a $40,000 scholarship to go to U of A. My senior year, I won it again. So I have like over $100,000 to go to U of A. It's kind of crazy. I am so grateful without SARSEF and without the amazing support here, I would have never been able to do it. I also probably wouldn't have been able to go to college. In the category of biochemical science and bioengineering, first place goes to Mackenzie Big. These are the people who are going to be solving all of the world's biggest problems within the next 20 years, 30 years, and 40 years. We've seen a lot of lives change and a lot of girls start to believe in themselves more and we're really proud of that. I'm gonna try to talk my brother and sister into making their science project 
so then like maybe they can have a chance to do it at Sorry So. The base that Sarsef gave me allowed me to go to college and allowed me to pursue my dreams, which is to help people. So I'm studying hydrology, which allows me to continue my project through the university doing research. And with my filtration device and the work that I've put in, I have the opportunity to be helping people within the next couple years, and I'm very excited about that.